sweater out of that. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Natique Yarns here in Elk Grove, California on a crazy winter day. I don't know if you guys ever saw, I don't think I ever posted um, a photo of the Santa that Everly picked out on Amazon and I did not read the um, description, but I had a 14 foot Santa, blow up Santa in front of my house. And last night, after getting back from the movies, it had rained, it had started to rain. And I was like, we better pull that thing down. It would have been in another neighborhood. It is super blustery. Um, I'll have to do a picture. I didn't even do it this year. My thought is now that I have a 14 foot Santa in front of my house, <laughs> do a picture every year of her in front of it so we can see like how tall she gets compared to Santa. So I hope everyone had an amazing few days off and you uh, enjoyed celebrating however you do. Uh, we had lots of food. We did, uh, let's see, try to think. The Friday before we met with, um, we call them the cousins, but it's basically all of our children. And so we had like, the family party and then Christmas was a very small um, with just a few people it was nice relaxing there was no chaos you know you guys all know I know you know sometimes family at Christmas is a real treat or in the holidays whatever you're celebrating so I was grateful everything's were everything was nice and calm and I enjoyed having yesterday off did you Anna? yes I mean you were driving but yeah but I got to drive before the rain started. Like, I got home before the rain started. Mm -hmm. And then I got to do, you know, the second half of my Christmas. Because since it's a little hard to do Christmas with the peeps in Alabama, we do FaceTime Christmas. Oh, that's what And we do. open everything. Mm -hmm. We did that with Loretta. It was actually fun. We um, basically sent it to the TV can't think of what that screen shared so Loren and Matt were nice and big while <laughs> we were opening presents it was really fun I hope you guys all had a great time I love spending time with my family um, I know that sounds crazy I'm um, okay uh, yes most of my family I will just say that so but we had no everything was great yesterday easy day went to the movies what did I see the Black Panther that's, mm -hmm. I'm like, that's not your kind of movie. <laughs> no, I'm the one who picked it. So now I owe him a movie. So that's how it is. If you pick a movie and it's a bad one, then they get to pick the next one. So we'll see. Good morning. Good morning. Well, we already know he's going to pick a bad one. Uh, Dan, uh, Lisa, yes. I have one of the features on my car is you have a outdoor light show. Seriously? I we'll thought she was joking. No, no. We'll have to do it one day. It's super fun. <laughs> But it's very loud and like your door, your um, back opens like the hatchback and it makes, oh, it's pretty cool. <laughs> well, I'll have to record it one time so you guys can see it. Um, I don't know, I'm loving this weather. I feel like we've had the first semi-normal fall winter than we've had in a long time. So I don't know about you guys, I love the rain. I mean, I would take this over the frigid cold fog we've had because that was crisp and who knows. I don't know if you guys have a warning on your PG&E, but I kept getting warnings. Like it was 250 then it was like all of a sudden 300 I'm like, $300? This isn't uh, Minnesota. This is California. So great time. Um, I don't know. Ready for a vacation tired are you tired yes very yeah. so lots of driving and fun and I can't wait to showcase if you guys were not looking at your emails our semi-annual clearance sale started on the 24th and we've been here since eight o'clock this morning getting out packages getting them ready to go but I thought before we talk about prizes and all that Anna can do a quick walk by to start at the end cap. There is so much stuff. There's gifts. I might have to get myself another pair of those no, pajamas. pajamas. Lisa Seville, you need those. There's yarn in 
all the different weights. Nor you guys There's that, kits. There's bags. I don't even know if I can. There we go. I'm like, I'm a little short for this part. Cindy said she has smud on this side. I have both, smud and pg and &E. Oh, you need a new roof, new windows, and HVAC. That's, uh, I would hope your bill isn't expensive. Yeah, if you've that. gotten all that replaced, your bill should be the best it can My possibly be. HVAC is from 95. So I realize it's not as efficient, and I have a two-story, which, let me tell you, two-stories suck. And yes, I have a different thermometer on both floors. It doesn't matter because heat rises and when you have cathedral ceilings it's just like goes up to the top so I don't know it's fine I'm loving it all right we're gonna talk about um our grand prize which we are super excited about this one this is for the love of the game out of savvy and rasta it is a $90 value. We will be doing the drawing live on Tuesday, January 3rd. How you get entered into the drawing every time you make a purchase. Whether on our website, natikyarns.com, or you come into the boutique. We're open Tuesday through Saturday from 11 to 5. You get entered in. It is cumulative. So if you purchase five times, you get five entries. And it just keeps rolling on. For the next time when you purchase during that time frame you get entered in so i'm excited to see uh we have rasta and dream and color savvy both are beautiful skeins of yarn i did finish kelsey's hat Yay. and everly's hat and i have enough to do a third one so i'm really excited about that so that's one skein of this i made one full hat for everly I used it in combination for a, color, a hat for Kelsey, and I'm going to use it in combination for a hat for me. So that's three skeins out of the three hats out of this one. Which is awesome. Kelly Scriven, the candles, I'm not going to lie, I bought 11 of them. I would buy them all. If you guys know, I'm in love with Capri Blue. Um, and I gave them to my kids, and all of them were like, oh my God, it smells so good. They smell amazing. It's a, uh, yeah. Those will go quick, quick, quick. All right, our daily prize is this really fun pattern that we have called Reflexion. Uh, we are using worsted weight cotton. Cumulus would be amazing for this. Um, you have enough to do a small or a medium, and this pattern is available on Ravelry. Um, originally the yarns were DK and lace held together, but it is worsted weight when you combined and, uh, just, just do a quick worsted section of that section. Yes. What's on the clearance? 14 cotton merino tweed, a couple different Noros, Luca, if you like a little cashmere. There is oh my God, not the Luca is amazing. There's not a shortage. No. I think this is the biggest clearance sale we've had yet. I think so too. I don't think we've ever done three tables. Yeah. 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 Nice three tables a and a floor. shelf and right. <laughs> and a All box right. on the floor. So how you get entered into the daily drawing is every time you react to the video right over here. So if you see something you love. Just give a shout out. Um, you could have another um, page open so you could be shopping or a different device because our clearance sale is when it's gone, it's gone. And I'm going to say we're each featuring something. I'm featuring Capri Blue because it's never on sale and it's just something that we have uh, decided that we're going to bring in something else instead. So these are first-rate quality candles. Nothing's wrong with them. It's just we're making room for new stuff. Now's the time to buy Christmas gifts for next year if you're like that type of person that you think ahead. Um, you can also get five entries for every comment. The more you comment, the more entries you're going to get. And if you want to get real bonus points, you can go to uh, the forward arrow, hit share now, share to your story, and you just have to 
shared to and where for your comments. There you go. And you're going to get 11 entries for every of that. For all your friends who like a good deal, today's the video to show. Because as you can see, we probably had 60 packages already that are making their way across the country. Lots of people took advantage of it while they were home by themselves. So let's see who is going to be the lucky winner of this daily prize. And this is off of, um, gosh, what was that? Saturday's video for yep. the stocking stuffers. So let's see who is. Ooh, Jerry Milo, congratulations. Okay, so Jerry, how you collect your prize. If you're local, you stop by the boutique anytime Tuesday through Saturday from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. And then if you're not local, the next time you place an order at natikyarns.com, all you have to do is put in the notes section that you have a prize, and then we ship it all out together in one of our pretty pink packages. Are we out of the bag? I know we were low. Um, yes, we are out of them now. Oh, right? There should be one sitting in the bucket, though, because, oh, somebody took it. We'll just put it like this for now. Oh, it's right there. Oh. Hmm. We can switch it later. Oops. I was like, it was in one because I brought it out in one. Oh, that's right. That makes it even easier. Transparent objects. They disappear. Yeah. But so much good stuff. We, we all have piles. Oh, yeah. In the bins, you guys know I'm in love with cashmere, so I'm like, okay, is there sweater quantity of uh, things? And there are, so uh, get it while you have lots of opportunities. So, congratulations, Jerry, on winning that daily prize. All right, so we are going to. Uh, talk first about a reorder that just came in this morning and we cannot keep this in stock. I think um, something I knit for Everly was the start of it. So I'm going to let Anna talk about it. I'm going to grab the other two colors that the other two ones that came in and you guys will be fun to buy. So for those who don't know, this is Dream in Color Abalone, which is an exclusive color for Natique. Um, this is a gorgeous kind of rainbow of softer colors. There's rose pink, there's lavender, mint, turquoise, lemon yellow. And this first one in my hand is Savvy, which is their super bulky. It's 100% superwash merino and 130 yards per skein. And then we also got in more of the fingering weight, which is the smushy cashmere. So you can see the colors blend together a little bit more in the lighter weight. Then we have DK weight in so Cosette, which is 270 yards per skein. This one has sold so well that we have never even be able, we haven't been able to talk about it because it sells out before it even makes it to the floor. And this beauty. Which is the worsted weight, which is classy cashmere, and that is 200 yards per skein. So that is a full restock of the, the brand new Abalone by Dream and Color. We have all four of the bases in stock right now, uh, obviously, while supplies last. Because this yeah. one was like, boom. Because uh, we had pre-sales of, I think, like 40 skeins of it. It's exciting. Yeah, so if you had a pre-order for Cosette, we'll be we calling will. you later. Yeah. We'll call you or you'll get an email saying your order is ready for pickup. Okay, so my, we each picked something on 
what we're buying out of the clearance and mine is capri blue candles i am in love with this oh my gosh i gave one to kelsey i wish you guys could scratch and sniff oh my god it's so good this one's a different one so there's different flavors so capri blue is uh an amazing candle company they're distributed by anthropology um, and I have been in love with this scent forever. So I gave Kelsey one of the big ones and my son takes it off. He's like, oh my God, that smells amazing. And then it passed around. So then everyone got one of the candles. So we have a few different scents in them. The most popular one is a volcano. That is their original scent. It comes in different packaging. We have it. This is the one I gave Kelsey. This light, it's like a, I don't know what you would call it, light aquamarine. It's a greenish blue. It's beautiful. It's totally her colors. Uh, it is a one wick candle. So here's what I do with mine. The first thing I do is I take the lid off and I put them in my stash because the smells keep the bugs away. So I don't have to stink like mothballs or I don't really want to smell like lavender. So I don't use lavender. I use candles. And then when the initial scent moves on, then I light them and then they burn and they refresh. We do have something that when you're burning them, if you like extra scent, you can put in some of the diffuser oil or if you're someone who likes the water and the vapor, you can put that on all your um, diffusers in your house and make your house smell amazing. I put it on cotton balls and put it in my stash, like in every spot their stash or in my knit objects because here's what I find. You guys know I love to knit with cashmere and moths love cashmere. I just found mm -hmm. it in one of my um, store-bought sweaters. There was a moth hole in one. They're bougie bugs. They are. So this, um, all of the Capri Blue is at its first markdown, which is 25% off. This is only $14.99 for the diffuser oil and the big candles are $26.24, originally $34.99. In the Volcano, we have this the color sea glass green. We have white. We have the blue like this. And one of my favorites is this one. This is the Gilded Muse collection. So what I like is when you're done with the candle, you can actually um, heat it up in the oven or boil it, get the rest of the wax out, and then you have a beautiful container to use. Yeah, I just did boiling water with mine because I wasn't sure if this beautiful paint on the outside would appreciate the oven. So I just poured boiling water and then dumped it out in the trash. Yep, this is White Opal Volcano. These ones are a little bit more money because of the jar. So they are on set, they're originally $44.99. I'm gonna have to get some more of that diffuser oil because that's what I travel with. Mm -hmm. We have the, uh, these are the little oh, refills mm -hmm. for, let me grab that because this is a great deal. And they come in a few different scents. This is the blue jean. This is probably the second most popular one. Yeah, this, I have these in my house. We also have them in the bathroom. But it's a plug-in diffuser, but it's way smarter than you think of for a plug-in diffuser because you can program it. It has spots for two different fragrance refills, like this little guy. Uh, and so you can have it be two different scents that in the morning it releases one and in the afternoon it releases two. And then you can control how much it releases. And these, I don't know if you guys, if you've ever used like Glade plugins kind of start to smell like they're burning. Mm -hmm. This never starts to smell like it's burning. It just, the scent just runs out and then it stops. Kelly's saying she can only buy one of the candles. You need to look in the different categories because we're, they are selling right now as we talk about them. 
So uh, just looking at inventory, the faceted ones, there are seven volcanoes left and four grapefruit and Prosecco. This is one of my favorites. It's a much more subtle scent. This is the Gilded Muse Pink Grapefruit and Prosecco. I love the rose gold. Much lighter scent. This one to me smells like going to the spa. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Like it just has this nice, light, slightly citrus, super relaxing scent to it. Again, I wish you guys had scratch and sniff. Kelly, the signature guard jar candle, the blue ones of the volcano, there are, there's only one left of those. Man, they're going quick. They're going quick. I'm like, I'm I think there surprised. was five on the shelf when we started. There were. I mean, this is one that I knew would sell. This is what I was talking about. This is a collabor collaborative collaboration between Pura and Capri Blue. There's little inserts. You can put these in there to refill. There's a million different sets on Pura.com. I love them. They're some of my favorites. And then from our um, order this fall, we have a few left. I mean, I love the coloring on this one. This is Pumpkin Dolce. Which has this kind of like cinnamony beverage kind of scent to it like it almost smells like chai i swear this says bougie perfumery plus fragranced candle it does and i looked it up once it's like because bougie is actually like french for candle mm -hmm. so it's but it's weird because there's a plus this in it fragrant candle but it's yeah it's weird. Um, all right. There are so many more Capri Blue. We've got lotions, which are amazing. A large lotion. What else is over there? Um, there is a few different scents of the Pura inserts. There's some small tins. There's white candles. Oh, there's a Havana vanilla left, maybe. That's a good one. Unless somebody claimed it. If you're a vanilla person, that one smells amazing because it doesn't smell like fake vanilla. It smells like vanilla. All right, Anna's pick. I'm gonna let you talk about it. Okay, I love this because smushy cashmere is never going to go on sale. Right, exactly. Only these kits are. So even if I like break them up and don't use them in the combos, I'm like, well, this, I'll just get colors I like and put them together or not later. So there's, these are the Casapinka curated kits, which means she picked out the color palettes for us for our event that we had this year. And there are three color and four color combinations, because as you guys know, she designs a lot of multicolor projects. Uh, so in the three color, there's this beautiful combo of True to Life, Crying Dove, and, oh, I think I did, what's the name of that? Time Away forgot this one time away which is the pretty speckle pretty aquas and corals okay the next one is in the three colors is my absolute favorite this one is bedtime kyoto sunset and cinnamon girl and then Last but not least in the three color combos, we have Jocelyn, Crying Dove, and Relish the Vote, this pretty fun speckly one. Then in the four color combos, we have the blues and greens in Azure Cove. Jessamine is this really fun uh, variegated blue-green one with the lime highlights. My absolute favorite green pickleball. And then the deeper aqua blue vivid. So one of that kit goes home with Anna. And then the other four color combination is the pinks. So you have 
whetstone, which is a silver with pink, purple, and olive green speckles. Jocelyn, which is the deeper pink. Um, I think, is that pinky? Yes, pinky for the medium pink, and then crying dove for the creamy white. So all of these are skeins of smushy cashmere, which is 400 yards of fingering weight. It's 70% superwash merino, 20 cashmere, 10 nylon. So you can get four color combos, three color combos. I mean, I basically got that one and that one and that one because I can't help myself. And like I said, smushy cashmere is never going to go on sale. It's only on sale in these kits. Oops. All right. So if you just fell in love, search Casapinka curated and those will come right up. Next, this was Susan's pick, twin silk. Not to uh, be confused that you only have to do socks with them. However, they are a technique for making socks exactly the same. There's 440 yards. It is a 55% wool, 25% polyamide, 20% silk. I don't remember how they do that. It's, um, I read it somewhere. It basically goes from dark to light and then starts at dark again so that you can clearly see where the halfway point is. Oh, here we go. So you guys can see here's the dark and then there's the dark. So you can go from one to the next pretty easily. And look at all the gorgeous colors that this one comes in. Like you can easily find one for anybody. You've got kind of more neutrals in the grays. There's some kind of olivey gray green, some lavender gray in the first color. Then you've got the reds to more kind of cranberry to plum. Then you have for the green people, lime green and gold and olive. And you can see there's a little aqua in there. Like the little sock pictures kind of show you what's hiding in the middle of the skein. And then there's kind of like the goes with everything, denims and silvers. There's the sunshiny orange and yellow. And then there's this beautiful kind of more teal palette. You've got like the muted teal, aqua, all sorts of beautiful aquatic blue colors in that one. So you've got a beautiful range of colors to cover everyone on your list. All right. So there we are with fingering weight yarn. All right. Don't worry, you guys, there's more. It just takes us a minute to switch between the different items. All right, Karen, who is the master of worsted weight yarn. Is that, I think that's her favorite. Is that your favorite, Karen? Well, she does a lot of bulky too, so. Yes. She's like me, we like some quickness, quickness to our knits. So it is not often that we um, put Noro on sale, but we do have Noro on sale uh, this um, clearance sale. So we are clearancing Okunashima, 
which is a worsted weight version of Noro in the most gorgeous fiber content. It is 35% silk, 28% wool, 20% Angora, and 17% mohair. The Angora, you can see because there is a slight haze to the um, skein. It is worsted weight and there is a generous amount of yardage on there. I think it's um, about 242. Yeah, 242 yardage. I was like, what the hell? I know, I'm like, you just had them. Where'd they this go? This is color number two. Really beautiful options. Uh, but depending on your size, four to seven or eight is sweater quantity. There are some beautiful cardigans that you can make out of this or a cowl. Um, lots of our patterns would work really well with this. Um, and I will let you talk about the color because there are some gorgeous colors in here. So color two has pretty red violets and lilacs a little silver, some kind of mauve taupe, blush pink. This one's very purple people colored. Then if you like more spring palettes, color four might be your jam. You've got kind of more of this chocolate color, a minty green, some emerald, rose pink, spring green, olive. This sweater would be perfect for it because this Noro is a little bit more subtle than the other um, colors that it comes with. This is the Terrazzo sweater by Petite Knit. Oversized, really cute uh, cowl, very simple first sweater. It's knit on sixes and eights. Uh, but you can see this more subtle look is what you're going to get with most of the colors here. And size-wise, extra small, you would need, um, let's see, we'll say six of them all the way up to a 3XL. You're only going to need seven of those, six to seven, really. Beautiful. So the terrazzo sweater is worked from the top down. The yokes worked flat, back and forth on circular needles while the neckline's being shaped. The work's joined to be knitted in the round. And it's constructed with shoulder increases on both the right and the wrong side um, rows on the first section. It's got really great details. See, this makes you rethink the yarns, right? Like I'm like, oh. I could definitely wear a sweater out of this. And I actually like the more subtle. I would probably do something like this color because I still need to stay true to um, what colors look best on me. Which This is color 19, which has some indigo, some charcoal, lavender, silver, a little bit of that kind of pinky red violet, some kind yeah. of soft chocolate. Very beautiful, kind of purple, gray, and a touch of pink in this palette. This is a cheerful one. This is color 11, which has kind of chocolates and fawns and taupes. Then it goes a little bit burgundy. There's this cranberry red, some soft violet. And if I flip it over, you can see there's some soft, like, spring green in there, too. Also, we know lots of you got gift certificates. Mm -hmm. This is the time to pull out your gift certificates. And it's free money anyway, and you get a discount on it. So it's extra bonus money. Yep, make the most of it. Mm-hmm. This is another one that I'm like, ooh, maybe I would do a sweater out of that because I really like that color. This is color three, which is 
like springy sky blues and a little bit more cerulean. Then it goes to like this blue violet. There's little highlights of almost that bright cobalt blue in there, just a touch darker. Some super soft lilac, some aqua, all kinds of good colors if you're a blue person. All right, this is a nice one for people who may want a little bit of color. Color number 18, it's like a soft jewel tone. It has kind of cranberry pink, red violets, emerald green, some of that sky blue, some softer cobalt, some olive green, a little bright turquoise. Melanie, my gift certificates only last two days. Hey, this is my thought because I used to spend my gifts, uh, save my gift certificates and then I'd lose them. Now I spend them within the next couple of days because I may misplace them and then I really lost the money. And what's nice, gift certificates never expire in the state of California. Color 20, which has red violets, lilac, purples, natural white, some fawn, some springy olive green, some caramel. Heather, I'm sorry we don't have time to recap it, but you can watch the video again and um, you will be able to see which color goes with what. They are also are pictured on the website. Then, see, this is what color one is supposed to be. It is, the neutral. The neutral creamy white and charcoals and chocolates and fawns and taupes. Like this is the original color one where it's all just neutrals. I think we should all make something. Oh, look it. Here's one. Oh, there's one with the pink there's on the outside. Color. I'm like. There's 14 colors of Okunashima. Yeah, there's your oh, color right thank there. You, Suzanne. This is my color. Maybe we should do that. 15. We're gonna have our knit, our knit together. I'm willing. This one has orchid and fuchsia, lavender, a little burnt orange, some silver. And this is if you're wondering how where it is on and I can come over here and show you. This is the pinned comment you go to. Just click right here. It opens up. And then here are the colors. I think these are a really nice representative of the colors. I mean, there is a, we didn't even show them all. Those are the new ones. But it still has a good, let me see. I have to click here. So there's good representative. There's full pages for a bigger one, but now that you see it, you can see how that would be really, some are a little brighter, some are a little bit more subtle. There's all different ones. All right, we're gonna talk about what we're wearing because we've had about 50 orders come through as we've been online and we're trying really hard to stay on top of it to not overwhelm ourselves uh, when, you know, have to come in at eight o'clock this morning. So. I am wearing Goldfish Memories by Casapinka. This would be perfect with one of the three skein Casapinka curated kits in her style. It really does um, showcase well. I've got a cream, which is a little bit hard. Next time I would have done something different. This was my first Casapinka because I'm not normally a shawl person, but I loved this. This was all souvenir yarn from a trip that I had been on. So I've got a cream, I had this orangey one, and then a pink one. A little too subtle now, but I, I still, I love it. It's still one of my favorites. Goldfish Memories. And let me show you what Anna is wearing. And there's lots of options of this weight yarn to make this.
This is the No Need to Panic sweater, also by Casa Pinka. We did not plan that. Um, this is all just slip stitches, some yarn overs, nothing too intricate, but it changes stitch patterns throughout the yoke. And then once you're done with the yoke, you have knit, knit, knit for the body, a little ribbing at the bottom. I may have just done regular knit to purl too. I don't remember if the pattern had a unique ribbing or not because I stopped paying attention at that point on patterns. We just do our own thing. I just knit two purl too. I did a yep. split hem. It doesn't call for that, but that's easy. You just do back and forth on half the stitches, then mm -hmm. do back and forth on half the stitches. Yep. And I, of course, did mine short sleeve because I'm usually hot. Formerly hot. Yes. <laughs> then we have... This da, da, da. is Biscayne Merriment. Did, did um, she make this, design this too? No. Okay, well, it's a beautiful, and we have like three sets left that are on clearance. So get them while they're hot. This is the same kit that I made my ginormous um, slip stitch shawl out of can't think of the name right now. My brain's tired. Yeah, I don't know. And then Rainbow Warrior. Susan That's it. She's coming. Is wearing another yarn that is in oh. the clearance. My buttons came undone. <laughs> this is Mian out of Harmony. Yeah, uh, cotton yarn, cut stitch, hand or machine knit. Mm -hmm. Two skeins, I think. Two skeins. I think so. I can't remember. Because the yeah. colors repeat once. Okay, then yeah, two skeins. <laughs> That's All what right. I'm going with. That's it, my peeps. We are off to uh, package orders, but we are open 11 to 5. Everything that you've seen and so much more. It's really easy to get to it. Let me just show you guys because uh, sometimes people have a hard time finding things i'm not sure why but we'll make it we'll show you how easy it is uh we will have our opening slide go to clearance so that'll help you also but if you shop all go all the way down to sales and clearance here you are it's all there i mean look at this you guys yeah, cashmere, cashmere and beaded silken sequins cashmere there's so much cashmere on uh markdown right now and even within it just great options like the pumpkins 250 325 lots of goodies all right my friends we will see you soon and have an amazing day bye-bye